All right, greetings here from the West Lawn. Okay, so let's just jump right in today, okay? What um, we are in Parenting 101 today, okay? What do you want your children to understand about gender differences? What do you want your children to understand about gender differences, okay? Number one, be thankful for who you are, okay? That's one thing that I want them to understand when it comes to gender differences, that what I'm teaching my children is be thankful for who you are and what you were created as. OK, like how people say I was born like this. Be thankful for that. Number two, be proud of who you are. Make sure that you like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. OK, be proud of who you are. Then number three stand tall in who you are okay so when i say be thankful for who you are i know y'all see all this up here i i am a woman okay i am a woman even though i cut my hair i keep talking about how i cut my hair but i am a woman and i am thankful for who i am and i want my children to be the same way i want you to be thankful for who you are don't be here as a young lady and wish that you were a boy okay because that's not who God created you to be. If he had wanted you to be a boy, then you would have came out a boy. He wanted you to be a girl. And so that's why you were created as a female. Okay. So be thankful for who you are and who God created you to be. Psalms 139 says we are fearfully and wonderfully made. God knew us when we were in the womb. And he created us. OK. <laughs> OK. And so the second point is uh, be proud of who you are. Take pride. If you are a man, take pride in being a man and be who God created you to be. If I'm proud that I am an A student, if I'm proud that I am a college student, if I'm proud that I became a doctor, you know, I am going to wear those accolades, you know. So if you're proud of who you are, then you are appreciative of who you are, okay? So be proud of who you are. So talking about what you want your children to understand about gender differences. Number one, we said be thankful for who you are. And number two, be proud of who you are. And then number three, uh, stand tall in who you are. Okay. One thing that I call my husband, I call my husband Lord. <laughs> Some women going to come in below and say, girl, shut your mouth. But yes, I call my husband Lord. I stand tall in who I am because once again, I take great pride in that I am a woman. I am grateful to be a woman. I am grateful that I have a body that can bear children and that can carry children and that can be the glue to my home. And I love that. OK, so once again, what do you want your children to understand about gender differences? Number one, be thankful for who you are. If you were a woman, if you were created a girl, thank you, God, that I'm a girl, you know. Be proud of who you are. I am a woman. I am a woman. And be, and be proud of that. And then number three, stand tall. Stand tall in who you are. Hey, like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And as always, peace and love.